In question 10, we're given a table that shows the amount of uh, recycled items that have been collected over two days by both girls and boys. And we're also told that the boys and girls collect a total of 50 items over those two days. And what we're asked to find out is this missing value here, which represents the number of items that were collected by the boys on Tuesday. Well, we know that all of these values added together would equal the total of 50 items collected. So, why don't we work out the number of items collected by the girls. Well, if we take 16 plus 11 here, we'd get uh, 7, 27 items collected by the girls on Monday and Tuesday. And if we looked at the items for the boys, we'd see that they collected 19 plus the question mark. And we know that if we add all of these together, the 27 items collected by the girls plus the 19 plus the question mark, the number of items collected by the boys, they would equal 50. Now if I look at this number sentence here, I can add the 27 and the 19, and that would give me 46 plus the question mark equals 50. So in order for this to be equivalent on both sides, what would the question mark have to be? Well, the question mark would have to equal 4, because 46 plus the 4 would give us the 50. And we know that the question mark here is representative of the number of items collected by the boys on Tuesday. So there we go. We've got the answer. The boys collect 4 recycle items on Tuesday.